This video is about errors, detection and correction. Coming to errors. Whenever bit flows from one point to another, they are subject to unpredictable changes because of interference. This interference can change the shape of the signal. So, uh, types of the signal, uh, type of the errors include signal bit, single bit error and burst error. The term single bit error means that only one bit of a given data is changed that is from either from 1 to 0 or 0 to 1. Whereas burst error means that two or more bits in the data unit have changed from 1 to 0 or 0 to 1. Coming to redundancy. The central concept in detecting or correcting error is redundancy. To be able to detect or correct errors, we need to send some extra bit with our data, these redundant bits are added by the center and removed by the receiver. This, their presence allows the receiver to detect or correct corrupted bits. In error detection, we are looking only to see if any error has occurred. It can be um, yes or no. A single bit error is the same for us as burst error. In error correction, we need to know the exact number of bits that are corrupted and more importantly their location in the message. The number of errors and the size of the message are important factors. If we need to correct one single error in an 8 bit data unit, we need to consider 8 possible error locations. If we need to correct 2 errors in the data unit of same size, we need to consider 28 possibilities. Now coming to error correction method, we have two, that is forward error correction and correction by retransmission. So in forward error correction, it is the process in which receiver tries to guess the message by using redundant bits. This is if the number of errors is small. Now in correction by retransmission technique, uh, the receiver detects the occurrence of an error and asks the sender to resend the message. Resetting is repeated until a message arrives at the receiver and the receiver believes that it is error free. This is all about error detection and correction. Thank you.